guys! So it is Saturday, June 18th at 3.45. Sorry I'm starting the vlog so late today, but um, I just haven't been doing anything at all. I went to a concert yesterday, so I'm just like really tired. But I wanted to haul some stuff for you guys, so I have a huge box of stuff from GS Love. They used to be called G Stage Love and they changed their name, so I will have their website linked down below. And I also have a 20% off promo code for you guys in the description box. So, um, unfortunately there were a couple mishaps in the stuff that I got, so I wanted to talk about those first. Um, there was also a shipping issue, but I think it was because of FedEx, because my shipping date got pushed back like three times. The lady's trying to figure out what happened, but she did credit my account so I could get some extra stuff for the inconvenience. So thank you so much for that. Um, but I wanted to show you guys what I got. So sadly, two things shrunk. Um, not to the point, well, three things shrunk. Not to the point that it was that big of a deal, but they did shrink a little bit, which is a quality issue, so I did want to let you guys know that. So the first thing is this white top. It's just like V in the front and the back. And then I got the same exact thing in this olive color, because you guys know I love olive. And then this one shrunk as well. So it's a lot more cropped than it was originally, but it's this really pretty blue tie up top. And everything I got in this video in this haul is a size small, just so you know. And then the last thing was this jumpsuit. I wanted this in a medium, but they actually sent me the wrong size. Um, so it's way too short on me. <laughs> I'm 5'9". I don't know why everyone thinks I'm so short. Maybe I look really short in photos. I have no idea, but I'm really not that short. But for the rest of the stuff, because I have tons of stuff, I'm not going to talk about it because this vlog will be like 30 minutes long. So I'm just going to have all of the clips of me trying them on played with some music. <laughs> got a U plunge bra from them. It was like a cream color and it had clear straps, but unfortunately both of the straps broke off when I went to try it on yesterday. Not like they like unattached or anything because it is convertible, but they actually like broke in half. So I wouldn't recommend getting that bra, but everything else, the quality was great besides those three items that shrunk. So I hope you guys enjoyed this little mini haul and if you liked it, um, definitely let me know in the comments down below because I can start putting little hauls in some of my vlogs because I'm constantly getting stuff. So you guys can actually see the stuff as I get it and I'll even do little try on portions like I did today. But now we're sitting here drinking this huge thing of water. As you guys know, I just, I'm not a fan of water, but I really need to drink more water because um, I'm just constantly dehydrated and I have a headache. And I'm like sweating so I thought it'd be a good idea to actually start drinking a lot of water so I added some flavor enhancer to this obviously I know someone's gonna tell me oh you know that's a lot of sugar you should add fruit no I, I'm good so drinking this this is like a gallon this this is a gallon it's not like a gallon and then I'm also eating some Uts potato chips I literally never eat chips this is so weird it's like I'm enjoying it but at the same time I'm like I don't need this.
sure this is the first time you guys are actually seeing my face today. So now it is 11.15 and I'm actually about to head to the Giant because I need to pick up a few groceries. I don't have a lot of stuff to get because you guys saw how much I got in my little grocery haul in one of my past vlogs, which I'll link down below if you guys haven't seen before. But I do have a couple things to pick up, so we're just going to run there quick, and I'll show you guys what I get when I get out. Also, kind of random, but if you guys want to see like an everyday makeup routine, which is like my makeup that I've been wearing in all of my past vlogs when it's not all vamped up, let me know, because I can still totally do that. I'm not a beauty channel anymore, but I still know how to do makeup. So let me know if you guys want to see that. So I was at my best friend's apartment the other day in Baltimore, and someone just casually ripped out my mirror. I'm sure they hit it. Like, bye. If I have extra money to spend, I'll probably also run into GNC and get some of those, oh yeah, birthday cake bars because they are so good honestly the best protein bars I've ever tried so if you guys have never tried them I definitely recommend them they are like life-changingly good is that a word I don't know but it is now so oh my god later today around I think three oh, I forgot to put my watch on um around three we are going to see Finding Dory because it is Father's Day so we're gonna do that I just wanted to get my grocery stuff done. All right, mini grocery haul, here we go. So the first thing I got are some Skinny Cows. This is my favorite flavor if you guys have never tried the Snickerdoodle. It is amazing, the macros on these are really great. For one sandwich, it's 2.5 fat, 29 carb, and four protein. So this is a nice little snack to have now that I'm cutting. And then I got two things of my chicken. So this is like the shortcut chicken, so I got Honey Roasted, which is two fat, two carb, 17 protein, and half a cup or 71 grams. And then I got Rotisserie. I got some more yogurts. Everybody has been Snapchatting me saying that they tried the apple pie. Is it not amazing? So if you guys ever try these yogurts from my recommendation, please send me a Snapchat or something because I think it's so funny whenever you guys Snapchat me them. So I got two apple pies and these are 12 carb 12 protein and then i got one vanilla which is i want to say 11 carb 13 protein yes and i actually put this in my smoothie this morning which you guys saw and i love this vanilla yogurt this is the only vanilla yogurt that i've ever found that actually tastes good you know like some of the greek yogurt you taste the vanilla and you're like this tastes disgusting like it actually tastes bad so i usually don't get vanilla but the greek 100 one is so good and then I got some more blueberries because, like I said, I run out of my fruit real quick. And then I also picked up some more spinach. This time I got the local spinach blend. So it looks like there's some, it says Lola Rosa, Paris Island, Pak Choi. Pak Choi? I feel like that's not how you pronounce that. Bok Choi, maybe? That sounds a bit better. Um, Yukina Savoy, and then regular spinach. So there's a bunch of different blends in here. I eat this with salad, so I, I don't know. I love the taste of spinach, and most people don't, so I really don't care how dark the leaves end up getting. And then I got some more strawberries. So I got a big two-pounder of strawberries. This is just a random brand. Organic's expensive, and ain't about that life, unless, I don't know, there's some things organic that I'll get. Like, I'll get cage-free eggs if I'm getting eggs, but... There's just not that many organic things I get. I get organic spinach, but I don't know. You guys let me know your thoughts on organic and what you think you should buy that's organic. I know there's a website that tells you what you should buy and like what you should save your money on. So if you guys know, definitely let me know because I'm always wondering whether or not I should get organic for certain things. And then I just got some more raspberries, a big one as well, not organic. And then I went to GNC, so we'll do that after. I got my Powerades, of course. So my flavor, my flavor, my favorite flavor is the mixed berry. And I just got the eight pack. It has four tall bottles. And you guys know, I love my Powerade. I got another almond milk. So I've said this a couple times, I don't care about the brand, I just get whatever's cheapest, but the flavor that I always get is unsweetened um, vanilla almond milk. So I just got the giant brand one, and this is 2.5 fat, 
one carb, one protein in 240 milliliters or one cup. And then I picked up some more bagels. I stocked up on bagels by accident a couple weeks ago, so I hadn't had to get them for a while, but I picked up another pack of blueberry bagels. This is the Thomas bagels. I actually have never really tried any other bagels, to be honest. And in one bagel, it's 1.5 fat, 54 carb, and 9 protein. So these are a lot higher in carbs, so I'm soaking them up while I can. And then lastly, I got some rice cakes. These are the white cheddar ones. I got these because I heard Di Diana, is that her name? I feel like it was Diana. Diana Malloy talk about them. Um, she has a YouTube channel and she talked about how she has these with um, the Laughing Cow Cheese Spreads, which is exactly what I do, except I have the garlic herb one and oh my god, it's so good. So I got some of these and these are great if you're doing low calories because in one of them, it's one fat, eight carb, one protein. So pretty much they're like empty. And then from GNC, I went ahead and I picked up three of the Oh Yeah birthday cake protein bars. So I'm a GNC Gold member, so I get everything a lot cheaper than it actually is sold for. But to get a box of these, like a box of 12, it was like $30. And I was like, mm, yeah, no. So I just got three of them because I go in GNC constantly. Like they just know who I am at this point. But these are pretty high in fat. It's seven grams of fat, 24 carb, and 21 protein in one bar. Um, so they're a little higher in fat, but I've noticed a lot of protein bars are pretty high in fat, so I'm kind of used to it by now. But this birthday cake, this is honestly the best protein bar I've ever tasted. So it's really, really hot outside, but I get so cold in the movie theater because it's always freezing. So I want to show you guys what I'm wearing. I have this little crop top from GS Love. I don't even know what they're called anymore, to be honest. And then my jeans are from Fashion Nova. And if you guys remember when I first got these last summer, my body was completely different and they fit so different now. I'll actually link down the hall down below if you guys want to see the difference. But these are like my favorite pair of jeans. I'm wearing some sandals from Make Me Chic. And then I'm bringing this kind of lightweight bomber jacket from Fashion Nova. And it's like an oversized one, so I really like it. I'm honestly not doing anything else today and I just want to spend the time with my dad and the rest of the family so I thought I would just end the vlog here. If you guys enjoyed it please give it a thumbs up it helps out so much and subscribe if you're not subscribed already and I don't remember if I said earlier in the vlog but I'm not working at all this week until Saturday so if there's any specific videos that you guys want to see please let me know in the comments down below and I will be sure to film them this week while I have time but that's going to be it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you all in my next one.